Hidden Object Guru here with hot new game, hot very old game, The Fog Trap for Moths. Uh, I am the Hidden Object Guru, you probably know me better as... Bizdfnuk is if... That one was hard to say. Uh, and we are going to be checking this thing out. Oh, okay, well that's a dramatic opening. That's ripping off The Shining! But that's fine, rip off The Shining all you want. Oh, no. I don't think it would be post credit strong. I think Vladimir Putin... you got to remember, Vladimir Putin was, uh, was Boris Yeltsin's vice president, essentially. I mean, he was, he was the head of the sequel to the KGB. He was the head of the FSB. He's an important character in the story, Trump. In getting, uh, getting Yeltsin to resign. He's integral to the whole story. He's got to be a central character. Damn! Well, they made the mistake of stopping for lunch, and then a ghost... Oh, whoa! This got intense real fast. Guessing your daughter gets kidnapped? Very funny, Horror King. Damn! Horror King's trying to get people abducted by that character. You're not allowed to say his name, or, you know, he'll come and kidnap you. But they already did earlier. I know, so you're in trouble. Mean. I'm not the one who said it. It's not like a three times rule. No. So no, her daughter's been kidnapped. Who could have seen that coming? No airbags. Did you see the car? It's like from yeah. the seventies. All right, let's do this. Ooh, we're off to an eerie start. I'll be playing novice because I don't hate myself. Uh, yeah, let's learn how to play. Uh, curse changed to a large area. You can go in that direction. When the cursor changed to magnifying glass, you can get a zoom in. Hand, you can pick it up. Or interact. Did I just pick up a donut? I picked up a donut. Ugh. Wait, can I lock it in place? No, I cannot. You should always be able to lock your inventory in place, games. Don't have to constantly have it pop up like that. Oh, that's creepy. Is there a puppy in there? No, there's a skeleton in the puppy. Skeleton puppy in there. What might him make him let go of it? Well, he can't let go of it. He's a skeleton. Alright, let's see what we got here. Stuck to the headline, need to dissolve it. Do you, though? Do you really need that emblem? It's an emblem, obviously. Oh, but you knocked anyway. Oh, there's a lot to do here already. Alright, three more chicks. Sorry, two more chicks. And we're off the way, off on the way. It doesn't work if you just say it online, Horror King. You actually have to say it out loud. Which you might have been doing, I don't know. When a cursor changes to an air with a gear attached, you can use an object from your inventory. Crow won't let me have that. I need to... Oh, okay, cool. I can see a crow liking a donut. Uh, given the standard size of donuts, that crow is gigantic. Okay, Sergeant Greg Stevens, medical doctor. That's a weird thing. Uh, okay, military command shutting down. Operation Fog, uh-oh. You and your family are hereby ordered to travel sector F on Wednesday to be evacuated, Major James Parker. Tell me more about this Operation Fog. I would love to click in my journal. What, there's a map? Oh, hell yes. The game has a map, everybody. Oh. Where's the characters tab? Oh, there it is. So there's Gregory Stevens, Dr. Sergeant of the Military, took part in Operation Fog. Ooh. Alright, so let's get into the house vis-a-vis -vis the key. I actually meant via the key. Wait, you just said I had the key. Oh, I had to actually click on the key. I thought it automatic. You know what? It's not important. Mm, what I thought. What's a matter? What matters is what I did. Hit an object scene. Gramophone. You know, there was once a hidden object game where there was a gramophone on like the second screen in the game, and this is the gramophone in the third screen of the game. But I would like to see one where there's literally a gramophone in the first screen of the game. And don't tell me about the ones that the games that tell you to turn on, put on your headphones by showing you a gramophone. That doesn't count. 
It has to be in the game proper. I mean, it counts as a gramophone for my records, but it doesn't count for my the earliest gramophone in the game. Because that's not in the game. That's the opening move. Uh, Petrus and Photosteams took a few months after the last one. His daughter's health had declined even more. Oh, no. Oh, God. And this is all 20, 30 years ago? I don't know when the game is set. To open the gate, I need to find the keypad. Oh, yeah, and click it into the two uh, sensors. Okay, this is very Texas Chainsaw Massacre. You got this sliding steel door. Oh, that's plastic. I thought it was sliding steel. But you got these hooks in the ceiling. It's all quite creepy game. Bravo. All right, what's this statue about? Nothing. Gramophone is a hidden compartment. I will bet it will open if I play a record. Well, a specific record, maybe. What record do you think you should play to open the secret compartment? I said, what? Uh, I don't know. Open the door by the secret doors. Oh, right. I forgot about that. I found a magic case. When you see butterflies, click on the item to enter. Hidden object scene! Yay! Let's do this! Finally! Go for it, Horror King. Yeah. Orange lettering. You have to do something to assemble the painting. Place the Mona Lisa canvas in the frame. Obviously. This tutorial I can skip. Can you click elsewhere? I think it wants you to finish what it's I'll just do the do. thing. Oh, you don't actually have to drag it in this game. You can just click on one and click on the other. Nice. That's handy. Wait, the painting counted twice? That's weird. Also, that window's not going away. This might be broken. We might have broken the game by me trying to skip the tutorial, everybody. Is that Bart Simpson? I'm kidding. It's a leaf and two grapes, but still. Light bulb, dry sponge. Oh, those are the grapes. And I have to click here to... Go back to the main menu and resume playing. Oh, good. We're exactly where we were. So, like, if you click on something that you actually need, it's not letting you... Oh, I just clicked on the, the thing to try and move the grapes out of the area, and it didn't work. He was already insane, Horror King, so no. All right, uh, oven mitt, microphone, hat. So there's the record. Do I need the record? No. Oven mitt, microphone, hat, no, alarm clock. You do need the record. I do? Yeah. And so, yeah, no, the game's broken. I don't okay. know how I broke the game, but okay. Yeah. We broke the game, everybody. Not a problem. Just restart, and this time I will not have a tutorial. It was silly of me to... Oh, wait, I have to switch players to do that. I mean, we only just started the game. It's fine. But, you know. Play. Skip, skip, skip. Uh, novice. No. Alright. I need to find a donut for that weirdo. Well, thank God we found the problem so quick. Yes, yes, you want a donut. Okay, take the key. Read the note, leave. Look at this. Open it up with the house key. Go inside, go upstairs, find out about the hidden object scene. Now we're going to check the map to see if it displays where the hidden object scenes are. Actions available. It doesn't actually say hidden object scene. And you can't move based on the map, but at least the map will tell you where there's stuff you can do. I prefer it if you could move on the map, but, you know, this is the next best thing. Alright, so let's beat this, and then we'll put my lady to sleep, because she is, um, tired adjacent. Were you trying to say you were fine? Yep. You know you're not, right? That is an extremely topless statue. Oh, yeah. No judgment, just, you know. Well, it is a famous statue. Oh, absolutely. I was just acknowledging it. Oh, we took the light bulb and it got slightly darker. That's okay. actually pretty cute. I uh, got a cloche. And we need two phones. We've got no more co covered up items, so that's good. We need a hat, an alarm clock, forceps, a dry sponge. Or sponge, if you prefer. That's a hamburger. A tassel. 
that a tassel? No, that's the clicker for the... Sorry. What about that ornament hanging off the moon? Is that a tassel? No, that's like a um, pendulum. I mean, I know that there's a lot of overlap there, but it is a pendulum. Oh, there's the tassel. A phone, a mask. Oh, there's the mask. That is a gigantic mask. Phone, alarm clock, dry sponge hat. That is a mushroom. That is not a hat. Alarm clock, dry sponge. Oh, that was the alarm clock. So a dry sponge and a hat. Do you see them, my dear? I'm getting up, aren't I? Click in the... What was that? The hat. It was a straw hat. I wasn't click expecting that. Click in the... Um, That'd be funny, Horror King. The the uh, tr trombone. Trumpet. Whatever. Good idea, but no. Alright, I'm getting up. I'll be right back. But what? You're down to one. You could have just hinted it. Yeah, but I wanted to give it a shot first. It's directly to the left of the uh, giant mushroom that has a toad at the base of it. That might be like a statue of a mushroom with a toad at the base of it, now that I look at it more closely. <sighs> See? That's it right there. I thought that was a book. Oh my god! Check it out! Yay. They gave us three items! That's awesome. Oh, yeah! That's the dream, everybody. Tell me when there's another hidden item. I always do, lady. You are here to help me with the hidden object screens, and that's why I appreciate you. Okay. Screws are holding it shut, so I have to unscrew the drawer. Gotcha. Why does the mannequin need such a complicated lock? Because it's not a mannequin at all. It's the ghost of a murderer! Wait, what? I need you to look at this. Dry sponge, oven mitt, record. What's that below and to the left of the oven mitt? It's like a magnet. Okay, how do I play the record? Oh, do I need like a crank or something? That's weird. Hmm. Well, we got the rope and that's what counts. Did we know why we need... Look! The rope has a magnet. Oh, they're showing you the second item you need. So you need the oven mitt and the something, and you need this and the magnet. That's cool. And then I need a knife to cut this. Uh, got the crank for the gramophone? Yeah, damn right it is. Uh, yes, I did. And I said I, that would be great. Yay, we got two, one of the two baby chicks. Yeah, I didn't really think that would work. Now let's check what's up these stairs. What the hell is that? The lock is made out of an alligator skull. We got a safe. We need to find out what those things mean. And I need the handle. Oof. Night, Horror King. Night. Wait, what's that? So this is where cars go to die. It's kind of neat putting your uh, mailbox inside of a ruined car. I just... There's something in the hole in that tree. Aha! Check it out! I just found out that that symbol equals two. Because it actually says the code on here, but you need to know what the different symbols mean. Oh. And so that code there means that is a two. She's very tired, everybody. It's a pretty scary doll, I agree. Nope, that was not where I need it. Where do I need the codes? Does anyone remember where the the chickadee codes were? They were outside on the yeah, bird cage. There we go. Okay, solve the puzzle, click on the tiles that only until only white birds are showing. Clicking on a tile flips one or more tiles. That was cute and weirdly easy. 
a light sound puzzle with only six faces, and you never know which one is going to work. Huh. Fascinating and logical, too. This game's off to a great start. She agrees with me. That's what that yawn meant. I did. Great <laughs> second start. Yeah, that first star was not great. Not yet accessible. So there's stuff to do everywhere but there. Okay. Kind of wish there was just a map button. Oh, but I'm not going to complain. Damn, there's a lot of locations in this game. Alright, so you're saying there's something to do way back in the first screen? What? I already searched through there. Can't do anything there. Oh, let's see what the hint says. You think... Oh, there was. I have to give the dog a bone to get what it's got. That was embarrassing. Okay, yeah, the skeleton dog was happy to help. Yay, I got one of the three rungs. And see, once again, they show you what you've got, and then the two things that are missing. And the sunshade key, they show you what you got, and the two things are missing. Like, this game is weirdly well-designed when it comes to these elements. Yeah, the developers have really thought this one through. Sorry. Oh, I'm making you yawn. I'm sorry, you're making me yawn, you little monster. I don't judge you. I would be crazy to do so when you're so obviously wonderful. I am, aren't I? Yeah, that's why I said it. I don't lie. So are you. See a thing over here? Should light the candles in the chest of drawers. Do I have matches? I do not. Do I have a lighter? I do not. Okay. Can't do anything with this, but there is a symbol to pick up, and that is a case key? Oh, that goes in the case. Look, that's where the sun goes. Okay, but how do I turn it so I can get to the other... I mean, do I have to do the sun key first, or... Why can't I use the case key? Oh. Wait. The case key opened the sun. Well, I'm confused. The picture goes... Oh, wow. This is so weird. So every time I find one of these symbols, I need to pop it open. It's the other half of the sun key! Yes! I guess I wasn't supposed to use it here. Blat indeed. Alright, what do you think we can still do up here, buddy? We can pick up that item. Well, that was embarrassing. Oh, it's the second one of the rungs. Yeah, but I don't know where the ladder I need to repair is, so finding all these rungs isn't exactly helpful. Oh, I found half the painting. Forgot about that from the first time we played the game. Uh, okay. I need something to dig there, but I don't have a shovel or anything like it. I'm all shoveled out. <laughs> okay. My lady's going to need to get to sleep in about three minutes. So we're going to be wrapping this up in a second. The fact that you were unable to say I'm good might technically suggest that you're actually very tired. No, keep scratching me. It's fine. I'm not complaining. Oh, that's where the sun-shaped key goes. I'm not comfortable with a gator-themed lock. Whoa! It's dwarves, though. You and I have occasionally slightly different takes in the word of dwarves. This is turning out to be a very Halloween-y kind of game. Yeah. All right, iron, handcuffs, golf club. Iron, handcuffs. Three butterflies. There's one. Three butterflies. Thank you. Uh, is that one to the left of where that one was? Uh, where? There. Right? Yeah. No, that's a. What is that? A slug. Block, rung, fan. Oh, there's your shovel. Thank you. Uh, you need a watering can, which is obvious. Is the block? Oh, yeah. That couldn't be more obvious. Are you going to click on it? Of course. What do we have to do with it? Oh, that's weird. I'm very confused right now. What are we supposed to do with it? Water something? It wasn't in yellow. I'm so... Oh, wait. Yellow flower. Water the flower right there. Right. Which flower? The, the flower right to the left of you. That thing right there. Oh, okay. Thank you. And then we get both of them, right? Yeah, that's adorbs. Okay. It's weird to... And this is another thing this game is doing, right? It's making it so the item... Both items you have to use in an orange situation are on the screen. So bowling ball I don't know that I've ever seen the, before. Yeah. 
Thank you very much. Teapot is Run. up there. Oh, no, that's not the one. Teapot is yes, up there. Yes, it is. I got an axe that I don't need. Say rung? Yeah, for a ladder. Oh, okay. You see, on ladders, steps are called rungs, which is weird because there's a thing called a step ladder. Those have steps, not rungs. Uh, okay, got the boots. You need a bird. A burb, a rung, a fan, a butterfree. Oh, there's the butterfree. It was a picture of a butterfree this time, and a golf club. I thought that was a golf club. It looked like a putter. Oh, there they are. Wait, I want to point out that there are three golf clubs here. One, two. They only wanted the the wood golf club. Uh, rung, fan, burb. Oh, that was the burb. It was, again, a picture of a burb. Hey, slow, because children are playing. That's nice. There's the rung, so we just need a fan. Uh, what is that? Hey, See, look, they the got a surgical mask. Baseball glove? I don't. Yeah, I do. Yeah, okay, so the, yeah, what's that? I think it's a brush, like a shaving brush. Oh, it kind of looked like it was in a fan. No, it isn't. No, no, it does poof oh, wait, out like a fan. Is that the fan beside where the yellow flower was? That? Yeah. No. Okay. I think that's a weight. Although, again, I could be wrong. Is this thing here the fan? No, that's a drawing of a person on the wheelbarrow. Oh, do you think it was a drawing of a fan? Uh, no, that's a drawing of a fan. Yeah. Oh. I see how you thought it was a person, though, with, like, like uh, yeah. spiky hair in the back. Yeah. But, yeah, it's a drawing of a fan. Weird. Lots of drawings in this game. I like it. <laughs> See? Block, shovel, rung. They give us tons of stuff. Oh my god, it's so rare that a hidden object game does this. And I'm always a huge fan when it does, because it respects our time. There he was. Half the keypad! Woo! Yeah, they're really laden us down with items. I love it. Anyway, we're going to take a break. I've been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, there's buttons for that coming up. Questions, suggestions, related whatnots, go in the comment section below the video. We will see you back here for more new and upcoming games. And, of course, the next chapter in Fo The Fog, A Trap for Moths. But until then, I'm going to say that's right. Au revoir.